Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Great Nikki Gaga, and we are at Vida the Twenty. And as, as you all can see, I went to church because a little testimony with you all today. I'm not going to be long because I don't want this video to be long, long, long and drawn out, you know. Anyway, so our pastor was talking about getting ready, you know, getting ready and be watchful because. We are living in the last days and so and I was thinking back because you know well first of all I grew up in a Christian right home. I grew up in a baptized home. when I was yeah, so nine. I got baptized. Okay. I knew God and I was living that life and then you know I don't know was when you, you know, feel you come, you come woman, you feel, oh, you could do what you want, you can drink, you could do this, you can go out and, you know, do what you want to do. But then thinking back, I was like, what was I thinking? What was I thinking? Yeah. Now I am changed. I'm completely changed. I'm not the person who I used to be, you know, some years ago. I used to be a drinker. I would go to parties. I would get drunk, you know. I would even on Saturday nights. I would go to parties, get drunk, you know, doing all those revelry things and whatever. And then Sunday morning, I will find myself in the house of God, drunk, drunk. I will be in church, drunk. I even went to church sometimes, and I sleep through the entire service. Now come tell me, if God was like man. He would have struck me down there, there, yeah? But thinking back now, I'm like, I don't even know what I was thinking. I don't know what I was thinking, you know? God has done so much things for me. Yeah, I don't even know. If I start talking, I will not even done. I was a lesbian, you know? I grew up being a lesbian. You know, I wanted to be a porn star. I wanted to be a porn star and things like that. And all those kind of things, you know? Um, I was a drinker. I wasn't a smoker, but I was a drinker. Um, I loved my liquor. I cursed a lot. I used to curse a whole lot of dirty words. I didn't even used to pray, read my Bible, and things like that. And then just looking that God has brought me from way back, from way from way back where I used to be. He has brought me, and I know that He has a purpose for my life. You know. I didn't even know what I wanted to be, actually, you know. He, he gave me my subjects. degrees, you know. I did other programs online, other courses online. I passed them successfully. He provided me job. He provided jobs for me. He provided a salary for me, you know. All those things I have to be thankful for because without, because without God, I don't know where I would have been. I'm just saying. I don't know where I would have been if it wasn't for God. But um, I just want to encourage you, you know. Whatever situation you have been in, just know that God is there for you. He is able to take you out of that situation and bring you up where you are supposed to be. Everybody on this earth has a purpose. Yes, everybody in this world have a purpose. You might not know what your purpose is, but God knows what your purpose is. All you have to do is just pray to Him, you know, worship Him, read your Bible, worship Him in spirit and in truth. Don't just worship Him because you feel like. Worship Him because you have to. It is your desire to worship God. Alright? So, just know God is going to bring you out of whatever situation you are going through. You know, he can take you from there and he can carry to, he can take you from point B and carry to, from point A and carry to point C. Just know that because we serve a, a one Sometimes you might be living in the world, you know, and it look all done. They are nice out there. They can't leave all the party and so on. But then when they get into the house of God, that is much sweeter. It is what it is a good thing to I can't even explain this one. It feels so good. It feels really, 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 really good to praise God, to worship God. You know, you get that feeling whenever you're finished, you feel so renewed again. Yeah. So God is a grateful God, He's faithful. You know, He's worthy to be praised. He is worthy to be praised. You know, and I, I, 
I mean, I don't want to say much, but I have to do a video one of these days with my testimony. I have, I have a testimony and I want to share it you, with you guys. But for now today, I just want you guys to be mindful, be watchful, because it's all a great and wonderful God. Do you know now? Yeah. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for stopping by this lovely Sunday evening. You know, I'm going to do more of these videos because... When, we, when I'm finished here with Vida, I want to do Super Soul Sunday, every Sunday, you know, and I have some special things coming up for you guys in October because that's our um, independence in St. Vincent. I'm going to share my culture with you guys. So I have